Go ratings, Poké fans! Michael here, and welcome to the newest episode of my Pokémon Silver Let's Play, my very first Johto journey. Do -do 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 -do. In Gen 2, that is. Anyways, last episode, if you missed it, be sure to go check that out. Also, don't forget to leave a like on this video if you're enjoying the series. But anyways, uh, I did a bit of grinding off camera. Um, I got Ed to level 15. I didn't want to evolve him off camera, so I just stopped at 15. A uh, little bit, you know, I have to do it. We're gonna do a little bit of leveling up on camera. Sanic, same. Muscle is up to 17. Rocky is up to 20, just because I was switching him in for several things. Alfred, it's HM slave. And Kenya is up to level 17 as well. Took a little bit of time, but I did it. So what we're gonna do now is I have Jubilee's 3DS right here, and I'm capturing both. It's actually my capture card 3DS, it's just her games on there. And so I can easily switch between displaying her game or my game. So, Cause what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna evolve Abra into Kadabra and then trade to her. And I'm gonna ha get the uh, the footage of it evolving. I don't. I'm not gonna have the sounds of it evolving, but whatever. <laughs> I'm a bit of a headache, so I'm like drinking lots of water, trying to make sure I don't like, you know, I'm not dehydrated or anything like that. You know what I mean? So, uh, Rocky dug a hole. Alright. Oh yes, enough to one shot. It's not enough to one shot the higher level ones, but wait, how close are we to how close are we to sixteen? One fifty seven, okay. That's not too bad. That's only like two more battles. A ditto. I tried to catch one of these off camera and couldn't. So that was stupid, and we're just we're just gonna run from you. Screw you, Ditto. I like wasted all my Pokeballs on. I'm so poor now, guys. I like had to buy more potions and the Thunder Punch TM, and so I like I have like no money. <laughs> so, Pokemon. Hopefully, I'll get quite a bit of money from the gym trainers. Also, remember last episode? I noticed that uh, Muscle was a girl. I later realized that's even better than I originally thought because that means it can't she can't be attracted by Whitney's mill tank so that's like it's so perfect okay 52 exp okay maybe three more battles <laughs> I keep forgetting that uh it can't like <laughs> it gets the experience gets split so it gets much less if this thing puts Rocky to sleep I'm running because that's the worst thing ever just sitting there trying to wake up okay that's fine Let's see if we can one shot with rock throw do we do it ah oh, so close yes oh thank god I was about to be like no all right, finish the Okay, should only take one more battle. Knock on wood. My desk is wood, in case you didn't know. All right, another drowsy. Okay. Go, Rocky. Okay. Haha, you can't disable anything. I like how he just, like, when he digs, he just makes such a nice, neat little pile. You know, very considerate. Rocky's a considerate Pokemon. You know, it makes it easier to fill in the hole later. Oh, come on. Alright, it's fine. We'll just tackle it. Alright. Takel. Is this enough to do it? Yes, it is. All right, Double D is evolving from a bra to a catabra. Fantastic. 
Now we can actually... Well, it's gonna learn confusion, right? Booyah! So now it can actually do things itself. Also, it knows teleport. I don't know why I forgot that this was a thing I could do in last episode, but I realized it while grinding, so. All right. It's time for me to figure out how you trade. <laughs> I believe you do it upstairs in the Pokemon Center. Jubilee is already in the Pokemon Center, so. We've got both 3DSs right here. She was nice enough to let me. She was like, I don't care if you trade and trade back while I'm not here, which is nice, because it's still Friday, and I'm still wanting to try and make it far enough in this game to get Lapras today. But I'm a little bit scared because it's 2.30 and I haven't even beat Whitney yet. Alright, are you the trade person? Co Coliseum, no. No. Okay, that's the virtual console thing. Um, the Cable Club Trade Center. Okay, go in there in Jubilee's game too. Uh, yes. Before opening... Yes. I'm sure plenty of you have done this as a kid. It, or now. Alright. Invite a partner to- Okay, this is getting fancy. Invite a partner to play with you. Join a partner who has issued an invitation. Alright. Please come in. There we go. Here we go. Okay. This is fancy, guys. I'm doing the nerd trade in the Gen 2 game before, obviously, because I played it. Alright. We're going to trade Kadabra. And we're going to trade Rattata. She caught a Rattata and named it Trade Fodder on stream. By the way, if you want to watch Jubilee's playthrough, make sure you're following me on Twitch and her on Twitch. Because she's going to start streaming on her own like very soon. We're building her computer very soon. And by, probably by the time you're seeing this, she's already started streaming herself. So follow Jubilee Blaze on Twitch. Oh no, we'll trade <laughs> her, her, game, her character's name is... Uh, <laughs> is oh no, which leads to some very amusing dialogue. Okay, I got the Radita. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and switch to hers. So this is Jubilee's. Uh, this is you're now viewing Jubilee's gold. And there's Ed. Alright, Kadabra has shown up in Jubilee's game with a different sprite. Because Gold and Silver did that. That was cool. It is evolving! Excellent. Alright, you're not going to hear the sounds for this, but you get to see it. Anakazam! This is going to be so OP for just the rest of the game. <laughs> Which is fantastic. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to switch back to my game. All right, and we're gonna trade back. So I'm gonna send you the Radita of Jubilee, and I'm gonna send you the Alakazam. All right, and I have the Thunder Punch TM. I cannot currently afford the Ice Punch TM, but hopefully I'll be able to after Whitney's gym. Oh no! Bids farewell to Alakazam. Well, this is fun. Trading with myself. I mean, it's trading with Jubilee, but, you know, whatever. Sick. <laughs> Double D went from being completely useless to probably the strongest member of the team, like, very quickly. <laughs> Rad to heading over to Jubilee. Radita was sent to- oh no! <laughs> Alright, I think we're good now. Trade completed. 
I'm gonna have to do this a couple more times uh, for muscles and uh, for muscles and Rocky, but that is not yet. So hold on. There we go. Just gotta leave both places. Communication has been lost. I know that was intentional. All right, let me save Jubilee's game. All right, so that is done. And I'm going to teach Alakazam Thunder Punch. Yes. All right, Ed. Booyah! Now I can I can hit water type Pokemon now. All right, let's let's beat the absolute crap out of Whitney's gym. Let's put muscle in front. Let's do this, boys and girls. By that I mean my entire team is boys except for my Machop, which I never expected would happen. Is that the gym? What does this say? Your playground, Golden Run City Game Corner? Oh, no. I'm not a gambling man. But where's the, here's the gym. All right. I'm gonna fight all the trainers in here. What up, Chica? Aren't you a cute little trainer? I like you, but I won't hold back. Are you hitting on a child? I'm 10. Oh my god. Wow, that... This seductive chick is hitting on a 10 year old. I'm not sure how I feel about this. Karate! Chop! Found out that low kick in this generation is not based on weight. It's just 50 base power and has a chance to make him flinch. So, fun fact for you. All right, you got this muscle. Karate! Chop! Nice. I like how this is going so far. I think it's a level 18 with just this one trainer, just under Sentrits. This creepy hot lady. Fantastico! I like it. This is great. We have defeated and grown to level 18. My muscle lady is putting in the work. And now you're gonna make me walk around, which is so rude. Okay. I will not be skipping any trainers. Fight me, lady! Give me your best shot or I'll take you down. Okay, see, that's, that's fine. That's not hitting on a 10 year old. Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. I'm gonna knock out your entire team with this one matchup. Do I get money? Okay, come on, muscle. Well, at least the growl somehow missed. Nice. I didn't need to grind muscle up as much as I did, to be entirely honest. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. That did indeed hurt. Can I use teleport indoors? Because I don't want to use my potions, because I only have four. Seismic toss. Uh, yeah, sure. Um... I think Focus Energy. Leer could come in handy more than Seismic Toss. Leer could come in handy more than Focus Energy, I mean. I picked up 32! Wow, that was a lot less money than I thought I was gonna get from that. Can I teleport in here? Nope. It's dumb. Yeah, I, I know it's lame that I have to go back and heal, but like, I... I'm so poor right now. Look at this. Look at how much money I have. Oh, I have a lot more money. Wow. Okay, that went up reasonably quickly. 
I'll buy Ice Punch after the gym. Because... Gotta have Alakazam knowing the proper punching moves. Ugh. Keep missing the door. There we go. Alright, we're gonna heal. We're gonna head back with Muscle, my buff little lady, and she's gonna... Karate chop everything to doom. What does Seismic Toss do in this generation? Is it the same where it's like it does the same amount as your HP? Because that's what it is in the current generations. Let me see. That's the wrong Pokemon. Uh, Muscle. There we go. Move. Okay. That's what I thought. What is the power of Thunder Punch and Ice Punch? I probably should have looked at that. 75? Okay, it's the same as it... It still is. <laughs> Alright. Back to the demon lair. I'm admittedly, like, I feel like I'm way more prepared for Whitney's Mill Tank than the first and only other time I battled Whitney's Mill Tank back in Soul Silver. But I'm still pretty scared. <laughs> Hello! Don't think I'm a pushover. I don't. Nope. No worries about that. Carry. That's not all. Alright. Karate! Ah, so close. Alright, so if it didn't one-shot a Snubble, there's no way it one-shots the Mill Tank, so I'm thinking I'll go for Low Kick on the Mill Tank. Or should I... See, Karate Chop has the chance to crit. A higher chance to crit. Low Kick has the chance to make it flinch. So should I go for the flinch and, like, trying to get it to not attack? Or should I go for the crit and try and one-shot it? Okay, one more girl, it seems like. Yeah. Alright, so I am gonna go back again. Sorry that I'm super lame. <laughs> but you take no chances with Whitney's milk tank. Oh, Bridget. Zulu! Pa! My that Jigglypuff impression wasn't as good as it normally is. I'm a little sore in my mouth, so it's like making me talk a little bit funny. Most words are fine, but that kinda hurt. <laughs> Another Jigglypuff. I'm just gonna be smacking these balloons all over the room! And there's that crit. Level 20, wow, okay. We gained three levels. This is why you get the trade Pokemon, guys. Grow so fast. Jigglypuff goes down. All right, guys. I think Muscle's actually gonna be level 21 when we face off against Miltank because her Clefairy should make it level up. Which is, this is about to be exciting. And now we will teleport. <laughs> Let's do it. It's like, you know, a couple yards down the road, but I did it anyways. You may see my Pokemon. Thank you, Nurse Joy. I appreciate you and your assistance. Alright guys, here it is. We're about to battle Whitney's freaking mill tank. I think I should go for the low kick though, because I want to keep it like, if I can make it flinch, that means it cancels a rollout chain. I 
I guess it'll depend on how the battle goes. All right, we're gonna make this stupid little girl cry. Let's do this. Ha, and Whitney. Everyone was into Pokemon, so I got into it too. Oh, so you're just a sheep. Okay, just do what everybody else does? Way to be original and creative. Pokemon are super cute. Okay, that, that I have to agree with. You want to battle? I'm warning you, I'm good. I know. Let's do this. Whitney. The Clefairy comes in first. Should be a swift destruction with Karate Chop. Booyah. Muscle grows to level 21. She will be the destroyer of worlds. Moo moo. Alright. Low kick. Okay, gotta cancel this. Muscle! Thank god I resist that. I didn't actually know fighting resisted rock. Fun fact. Okay, we hit it. But I don't outspeed it. Okay, that's something I need to keep in- Okay. Karate Chop, hope for the crit. Okay, this is getting sticky. I might need to switch in- Might need to switch in Onyx. Alright. Can we survive another rollout? I actually think we can survive another rollout. Yeah, I think we can survive another rollout. No! God damn it! All right. Okay. All right, Muscle unexpectedly went down, but Rocky, Rocky with his incredible defenses, <laughs> lives a very powered up rollout hit. Sob, wah, you're mean. Go to hell, you stupid hoe. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was excessive, but I hate Whitney and Miltank so much, and I'm so glad we, I like, that didn't, like that was a fair win. Like. That was a fair win. I only used two Pokemon and no potions. Sniff, what do you want a badge? All oh, right, I forgot. Here's the plane badge. Freaking thank you. God. Whitney and Miltank bring out the worst of my human nature. What well, is this the TM for? Is that attract? Okay. All right, I never have to see you again, thankfully. Goodbye, you stupid, terrible person. And now we get to continue on. We are leaving this town behind us. Also, I haven't gotten the Eevee here. I don't wanna deal with it right now. I'm not gonna use it, so I'll get it later whenever I feel the desire. For the Eevee. Yes, plus. Alright. Well, uh, let's put, uh... Let's put... Ed in front. Because Ed is the lowest level and neither... He's gotta get some reps in now that he's an Alakazam, but also I need to buy the Ice Punch TM because I have money now. So let's check that out. I think it's the fifth floor. It's terrible elevator, my god. Admittedly that was fast, but it's still scary. An Icy Punch. Uh, one is fine. Thank you, sir. Nope, nope, don't buy another one. My god, don't buy another one. Uh... 
There we go. Use. Yes? There we go. Is that entirely necessary? Not really. Because I am going to eventually have a Lapras. Hopefully today, actually. But Lapras doesn't learn Ice Beam till level 20, like 36, and I'm... I mean, it's nice in the meantime to handle ground types, you know? I'm gonna buy a couple more of these. Oh, I wanna buy Repels. I don't know how many of those I have. Okay, now I have no money. That's fine! <laughs> So let's continue onward. We still got some time left in this episode. I think there are some trainers in the National Park, but I also know I can skip them because I can cut. the. Uh, there's a tree over there I can cut. We'll check out the National Park. I was here earlier to get Dig, but I think there might be some... Uh, some some trainers here that I missed earlier. I was right. All right. Now we can use all the Kazam. Beverly, hello Beverly. Your snubble, I will confusion it. Double D. That's going to one shot. No way it doesn't. Ah, never mind. <laughs> Oh god. Oh wow, that did nothing. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. Alright! We did it. Alakazam defeated the little snapper. Are you a trainer? Okay, no. I don't care. But what are you doing? Are you a trainer? Yes, you are. More experience. I could have used these while well, grinding earlier, but I didn't. So now we're doing them. Oh, an Oddish. That's a type advantage. That's the. F ah, dang it! All right, I gotta move them. I gotta change the position of the moves. Nuts. Okay, that wasn't a bad mistake. All it did was sweet scent, but that's a mistake I know I'm gonna make in the future. I need to change that. All right. Cubone, bone, bone. No, this is a great opportunity for us to use Ice Punch for the first time. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> that's great. All right, way to go, Double D. Christ, is that her name? Is that is that how you say that? Okay, immediately need to switch these moves around. Um, I want confusion at the front because that's my best move. <laughs> Are you a trainer? Yes, you are. You're one of those creepy ones. Like, he's a Poke fan. He's just this guy with his, like, with his cute little son. Why did they give him this ominous battle start music? I don't get it. Holy crap! I bet we can beat this. Yeah, I bet it doesn't have any good electric moves, because it's such a low-level Raichu. Yeah! Way to go, Ed! My, my Pokémon! Okay, I don't care about your, your daughter's letter to you. That's, I mean, congratulations, you know? It's, it seems like you have a nice relationship with her, but is this another trainer? This totally is. All right, 
We're gonna finish this battle, and then we're gonna call it a day for this episode. And then we're gonna move on to Ecrotique City. <laughs> Schoolboy Jack. Another oddish that we will confusion ray to its own doom. Viva la revolucion. Aha! Disable. Uh, no. I, I've taught Pokemon Disable before and then never used it. And I feel like Teleport, you know, it's not useful in battle, obviously, but it's useful um, just for me to get back to Pokemon Centers, so... Alright, the Voltorb will be one-shot by the- never mind. I need to stop saying something's gonna one-shot, because when I say that, it, like, never does. Ed gets Psychic at, like, level 30-something by level up, so it'll be a while before he gets the best Psychic move, but Confusion's solid in the meantime. I just think it's awesome I have an Alakazam at this early in the game. Well, guys, Next episode, we're going to continue our journey to Ecrotique City. Had some great victories today in this episode. Sorry if I got a little intense, but, you know, Mail Tank brings out those emotions in me. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to leave a like, answer the comment question down below, and that is all I have for now. So until next time, we can Gotta catch them all!